All right, so this is probably one of the best kept secrets for solving the Rubik's Cube. I almost considered not sharing this with you guys because it kind of takes the fun out of it, but I figured, I don't know, maybe you could use it to like get a date or impress your friends or something. So anyways, uh, here goes. You can solve any Rubik's Cube starting in any position using just two moves, and you're just gonna repeat these moves over and over again. You're gonna turn the left side counterclockwise, and then you're gonna turn the top clockwise, so it looks like this. And you're just gonna keep on repeating this sequence over and over again, and eventually the cube will start to sort of solve itself. And just keep going. Sometimes it takes a little longer than others. Pretty simple. Show me the life hack that you randomly saw one day that is now an unconscious standard practice in your life. I'll go first. Probably illegal Google hacks. Part 1. If you Google this, it'll pull up a bunch of hidden webcams. Don't believe me? Let's check out the first result. This is in real time, and I can literally change the camera's direction. Show me the life hack that you randomly saw one day that is now an un- Okay, Tupperware. See how they always end up stained with orange stuff. Um, I had chili in here. And this is really annoying because nothing gets rid of it until I learned this little trick. So all you do, take a paper towel, you just use a small piece, put it in the bottom, a little bit of dish soap, then get a little bit of water, right? It's not even full, put the lid on and Shake. Let's hope I don't run out of time. Okay, so I hope I'm not like the only human on the planet to not know this, but a while back my dad came over and was watching me do laundry. And if you use this kind of soap that dispenses down into this little cup, you know, it's really convenient, but it sucks when you pour it out because all the stuff gets stuck on the inside. My dad, <laughs> my dad said to me, you know, you can just throw the whole cup in there. I'm like, what do you mean? I always pour it all in there. And he's like, no, just throw the whole cup in the washer. And then it washes itself. Hey, Alexa, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. Super Alexa mode, activate. What's up, y'all? This is for all the people who don't like beer and who want to use something other than their feet to open it. All you need is a glass and your favorite bottle of champagne. Mine's the cheapest shit kind. You're just going to give it a one-two tap, just like you did with the beer, okay? One, two. That was kind of sick. Okay, stripper shoe hack. When you got new shoes to get a better grip, do this. Okay, where's the hairspray? And put some hairspray. <laughs> life hack. <laughs> Here are some facts that you probably didn't know that one day could save your life. Part two. If you ever fall off the edge of a subway platform and onto the tracks, don't waste your time trying to crawl back up. There's a crawl space built for a person to go underneath in case this happens. If you ever, for some reason, ingest windshield wiper fluid or antifreeze, drink large amounts of vodka to keep it from shredding your kidneys to give you time to get to a hospital. If a tornado looks like it's not moving, it's actually moving toward you. If you accidentally disturb a beehive or wasp nest, do not run for the water. They'll wait for you to resurface and then resume stinging you. Just run as fast and as far away as you can, because eventually, they'll stop following you. If a deer is running across the road, it's better to hit it than swerve and run into a ditch. But if there's a moose in the middle of the road, swerve and run into a ditch. Hitting a moose is like running into a brick wall. 
TikTok made me buy it part one. So this was all over TikTok and I wanted to see if it would actually help my sad shower head that has the worst water pressure ever. So I changed it out to this big guide today, but I also didn't realize how contaminated my city's water is. So basically those little pinto beans you see removes all those contaminants that are irritating to your skin. And a look at that water pressure difference. I have no idea how it was able to change that drastically, but do what you wish with that info. It comes with three settings. There's a massage, jets, and the rainfall. Alright, call me crazy, but I think I just started something. You know, just get it right out of here. You got a handle. Keeps it warm. It does. I know, thank you. Look at my mom. If your window's never going down, here's a life hack to fix it. Ah! I was today years old when I found out. Tell me why I've been taking these little bad boys and just <coughs> popping them off with my mouth in excruciating pain when I could have just soaked them in a little bit of oil and water. Hmm, I wonder if my pasta's ready. Looks good. Has this ever happened to you? I'm going to teach you how to take them off. Step one. Step two. My husband was so sweet and he put the baby locks on all the cabinets. So now, when the baby wants to open a cabinet, he still can. So when I was a sophomore in high school, I had this teacher who would only let the students in her class use the restroom one time per semester. Well, one day I raised my hand and I was like, excuse me, I don't remember her name, can I please use the restroom? And she was like, no you can't because you've already used the restroom in my class this semester. Well, excuse me, you can't dictate my bladder. So I'm like all frustrated, and I started secretly texting my mom because I wasn't allowed to use my phone in class. And I was like, Mom, I'm sitting in class right now. My teacher won't let me use the restroom. And she was like, I'll take care of it for you. And I was like, okay. <laughs> so like five minutes goes by, and all of a sudden, my teacher's phone starts ringing. And she walks up to it and answers it, and she's like, hello? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, thank you. And then she walks up to me like so angry and she like slams the pass on my desk and she was like, since you have to go that bad. And I was like, yeah, I really do. Thanks. And I got up and left. I didn't even have to go to the bathroom. It was just the principle of it. I just roamed the halls. <laughs> I love furry raw cheese, but the hazelnut in the center of them is a choking hazard. So before I eat, I simply remove them to ensure that I stay healthy. Okay. We got a lion and cut it in half, took out all the stuffing and replaced it with rocks. And then we hot glued the front and back onto books, spray painted it all gold. And you've got your own custom royal book holder. Doesn't that look awesome? I'm going to show you guys a little hack. Um, just push diet so you don't get fat. So Miss Girl thought it would be a good idea to put spoons under her mattress, bitch. Not a fucking fork, a damn spoon. Okay. Girl, that shit's gonna fucking move. Oh, oh, I fall in, I can't get up. Okay, what is this? Girl's putting damn Velcro under the damn carpet. Oh, she's not gonna fall no more. Just like magic, bitch. Okay. So we're putting a fucking comb. Ew, the pussy hairs. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, so we are putting stones on the fucking sandal. What? Ew, the fucking toes. Ah, uh, yeah. Foot fetish boots, bitch. Okay, so we are getting a hanger and we are paint. Girl, this is so tacky. They would never sell that in Ikea. Okay, we're cutting up a damn shirt. What the fuck is this, girl? No, just fucking buy a damn laundry basket. The fuck? Some DIY shit. Okay, what is this? The damn jeans. We're gluing some fucking shit, girl. This... What the fuck is that?
users, did you know that the correct way to screenshot is by double tapping the back of your Apple logo? I just found this out. It's super cool. So basically, all you have to do is go into your settings on your iPhone. You're going to scroll down to accessibility. When you get into accessibility, you're going to go to the physical and motor section and press the touch. You're then going to go down to back tap and back tap is basically just you touching the back of your apple logo you can do a double tap or a triple tap after you get to double tap you're going to turn the screenshot section on and there you have it y'all this is so easy and so much more convenient i went over to instagram found a quote that i liked and i was able to screenshot it quickly everybody make some tiktok tiktok Life hack. When you're in middle class or metal working class and you're trying to make a ring and it's not being smooth, then do this. Get this. Go. Get soap. Then you put the soap on here and scrub for five minutes. Now put this away to be a good child. Then you need to unscrew this. Also, BTW, wash your hands so you don't get corrupted. What? No way! Hmm. The flavoring is so unhealthy. So what I do is I rinse them underwater, place them in a dehydrator for about 40 minutes, and then you will have the perfect healthy chip. Y'all, y'all got no quarter. Y'all can just use the key and pull it. And then if y'all want your key back, of course y'all gonna want your key back. All you have to do is push it in and get your key. Show me the life hack that you randomly saw one day that is now an unconscious standard practice in your life. I'll go first. 